All right, let's reprogram the shot lock. All you gotta need is a Phillips head screwdriver, so let's get right to it. Now the stock code is gonna be one, two, seven, eight. There you go. Now there's gonna be two screws on the each side. So what we're gonna do is we'll start with this one right here. Make sure that's out of the way. Here we go. These will be the only two screws that you'll be removing. Alright, now we're gonna do this cover. So you're gonna kinda like just palm it. Palm it against the slide straight up. So just palm it up. And it'll come straight out. So, alright, here's the lock mechanism. Just pull this out. Very easily just comes right out. Alright, so let's get to the reprogramming part. Alright, so let's get this new code in there. Now you'll see here A is gonna be number one, then B, then C, then D. So we're gonna go one, uh, well, four, one, two, seven. So what you're gonna do is press down on these two buttons right here, then start pulling them out. All right, so we're gonna need to pull this one. We're not gonna go with the eight. So place the ones with the zeros or just the black ones. I'm gonna put that to the eight. Alright, we're starting with A. Our number one, the number is going to be A. So we're starting with A. We're going to put that in number four slot. So you slide up and down like that when you got it right. Alright, so number one, we're just going to be B. Put that in number one slot. B is going in. Alright, number two slot is going to be C. Here we go. Got the C in there. And. Last is going to be 7. We're going to put the D. There you go. Now release the button. So let's move on to the next step. Alright, now get that little box and just slide it right back in. There you go. Let's get the cover back on. You'll just slide that right on down. Get this situated here. Alright, so let's get this first screw in. Make sure, now there's going to be these little grooves down there. Make sure that fits underneath those little grooves there and completely fishes. Now we're flush as with the screw holes there. So right there, you got to make sure it slides underneath those little pieces of metal. Alright, let's put the screws back in. I'm not going to go all the way just yet. Alright, we should get to go. So, let's test it out. We're in the lock position, so let's put the code in. 4, 1, 2, 7. There we go. Let's make it official here again. So, 4, 1, 2, 7. There you go. It's quite easy to uh, reprogram. Pretty cool lock. Nice. Oh!